Hi there guys, happy Women's Day. Um, just watching Emma Watson, He For She campaign, which is wonderful. If you have not seen it, go on Facebook, check it out. Check it out. Emma Watson from uh, Harry Potter. I mean, everybody knows her, right? Um, so, I hope you have a great Sunday. And remember, uh, women's rights is just human rights. There shouldn't be any question about this 21st century. It makes me uh, incredibly um, just shocked uh, to see how much injustice there is against women. And um, I've, I experienced myself and I didn't see it as much in Europe as I see in US and it really horrifies me. Um, the way men treat women here, um, but um, n I mean not all, maybe 10%, I mean there are bad men in all, all kinds of countries, but especially there are a lot of problems like in Africa and uh, you know, there is prejudice that women can be millionaires or successful business owners or uh, engineers, uh, even though there are inventors, engineers, and, you know, there is just prejudice, I mean, it made my decision to go into music instead of going for technical university, which I actually was very good in physics and math when I was in high school and I had the grades to do any uh, major I wanted, you know, I could have went into engineering, but because it wasn't an idea for a girl not cool to go to engineering, you know, the music seemed like, oh, you're good at music, you know, you're pretty, go to do that, because, you know, so, and it wasn't for me, just not in my character, so it's very important not to have this gender prejudice, okay, and that's the same goes for men, like, oh, because you're a man, you have to do, like, this career, you know, it's okay to be a hairdresser if you want to, uh, it's the same goes, you know, it, like, it, it doesn't have to be a question that, you know, this gender has to do this thing, this gender has to do this thing, um, and I think it's about time, and I, I, I really uh, applaud the uh, UN uh, women rights work, uh, work that they do. Um, they have a plan until 2000, uh, 2020, 2050 to really improve the situation that it is. Also, in, I think, um, you know, Middle East and these other countries, those countries need a lot of work in that. But um, one step at a time, and I'm really happy to see Emma Watson, who's a worldwide um, known person, you know, taking this uh, and blowing it up with her presence. So, yeah, really cool. And um, I hope you have a wonderful day. Love you, love yourself, know you deserve the best, and don't let anybody put you down or tell you you can't do things or try to control you or do um, things that, you know, uh, belittles you, diminishes you, and takes away your uh, human rights. So, bye. Love you. One more thing, I think the world is not going to wake up until we become more intelligent. Talking about intelligence, not all people are up to their age. You know what IQ is? IQ is your um, mental age divided by your development age. So you can be 30 years old and have a mind of 5 year old. So 30 divided by 5 times 100 to eliminate um, decimal part, that's how you count IQ, um, you know, produces very low IQ. So that's how IQ is determined by your um, development brain capacity, um, you know, divided by your chronological age. And until you know, we, 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 can't, we can't create equality when people behave like, like kids, you know. So it's important to educate yourself, to be 
be conscious and um, understanding uh, of other people's wishes and feelings and it's very important that's why education is very important to for to eradicate hunger in the world to eradicate inequality to hopefully eventually stop the war someday uh, which I'm surprised still is going on and God knows when it's gonna be over but it, that's the whole different story it's the religion and um, it's 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 bad you know what's going on there but um that's why you know uh, support each other support no matter what gender person is um, education uh, and work opportunities um, you know of course some people you can't support you can't help them because they are the worst enemy of themselves and they're gonna destroy you too in trying to help them so you know you gotta know when to back off and when you stay away just to, to preserve yourself you know you have to preserve yourself it's the instinct and some women think oh they are saviors they are needed because they want to be needed they can help somebody so that's very false thinking too you know you have to help and, and, and protect other people but you have to do it the right way you know with the right institutions and right uh, educated you know uh, groups and, and things like that but not sacrificing so so yeah have a wonderful day peace out and I, I really like what she said that uh, woman and man is like a bird. Um, it's like two wings. If one wing is crippled, you can't fly. Don't you agree with this? And I think we got to look at it that way as a society. You have to have both wings operating to its maximum capacity and potential. It's a nice... And I have one more question for you. Um, how will you support gender equality this year? How do you think you can, either if you're a woman, how you're gonna stand up for yourself, what you're gonna do, um, reach for hire, um, go to school, or uh, if you're a man, how you gonna support, the, support a woman, either a sister, your friend, your wife, what you're gonna do to make her feel like she can move mountains?